boas motinhas daqui que vocês é Ruben de capa e sejam muito bem vindos a mais um The Witcher 3 basicamente nós no último episódio o que é que a gente fez nós fizemos uma poção para encontrar o vampiro que supostamente anda a causar estas mortes todas ok se não sabes o que é que eu estou a dizer, a falar, um, checa aí o, o playlist, o primeiro link na descrição e bora lá, há mais um episódio. Ah, do Witcher 3, DLC Witcher Blog, já estava a esquecer, né? Uh, não bugues, cabal. Oh my god. Sério? Sério? Ah, sério? Sim, é mais fácil. Esta TLC é porque é por acaso está boa. Mas a TLC anterior também estava muito boa. Por isso chequem lá. Ficar assim. Boot blocks não usually work nights. Need to come back during the day. Ah, então, para aí. Acho assim. Ele tá fa, tá feito. So how would you explain it? Whether it pours for a week or the sun bakes our pates, we've always mud up to our ankles here. You can't blame me for Beauclair's fickle weather. Fickle weather? I've seen you. You empty your chamber pot in front of our shop each morn, so folks will dirty their boots go to you to get them cleaned. A far-fetched conspiracy theory, sirs. I'll conspire oh. to welt your bum with my belt. Come here. Leave him alone. Just who the spit are you? <sighs> a witcher. A witcher. And I'd advise you to go back where you came from. I thought witches defend men from monsters, not cheats from justice. Need to talk to the boy. You can chat to him all you like. After we tan his hide. So stand down. Nope. Not gonna happen. Won't it? Well, then we'll thrash you as well. Which is all the same to me. Okay. Let's not do anything rash. We'll set up your legs. Circle him! Teach you to help Scott Lord. She can all of it. She can You'll never learn. Caputa de Suva. Assim é que é. What's the meaning of this? The brawl? Who started it? I'm investigating the beast on the Duchess's orders. Ah, yes. We've heard of you. And these men. What are they doing? Obstructing my investigation. Understood. Right. A few days in the clink ought to teach them not to impede official Dutchy business. Come on. Yeah, so buzzing. I'm gonna follow the garot. You're very good with your fist, sir. Wouldn't be looking for work, would you? We'd make a fine duo. Listen, I'm interested in a certain gentleman. Oh, wait, wait! Before we get to talking, please, take a seat. Uh, but bye -bye. my boots are clean. In this city, no boots are clean unless they just come off my stamp. A seat, sir, please. Mm. So then, 
Who was it you wanted to ask about? One of your patrons. Tall, elegant black frock. Not from around here. An arrival? Hmm. Indeed. I hear a faint bell ringing. A modest sum might make it sing out loud and clear. How much? Oh, you? Let's say... 500 crowns. What? Gotta be kidding me. What would you even do with that kind of coin? Expand my venture. I'm sure you can imagine. Have a proper stand with a big sign. I want a new box too. New polishes, new brushes. And if I've enough coin left, I'll buy a share in a launderer's. Get waste water for free. Hmm. <laughs> Got it all planned out. I should think mm. so. Capital is all I require. Hey. All right. Let's see if we can't figure something out. Ora. É de quatrocentos é quatrocentos. Hmm. It's not quite. I don't know. Ah, sério. Ah, see, I knew we'd clinch it. Just one problem. Don't have the coin. See if I can't get some, then come back. I shall patiently await your return. Oh my god. A sério que eu tenho de ir buscar dinheiro? Este gajo é um chupista do caraças. Tenho de ir aqui para depois botar ali. Ok. Parado. Tem de ver se eu consigo arranjar do dinheiro. Vender alguma coisa que eu tenho aqui. É que eu não tenho mesmo esse dinheiro comigo. Se calhar vou dar um ligeiro corte enquanto não vou para lá, ok maltinho. E já volto. Ah, e bem maltinha, parece que voltamos. Mas já que não pode. Well, não posso mais. Noble, sir. Please, take a seat. É, já Tell tenho me, dinheiro. Sir. Have you gathered the sum we spoke of? Yeah. Here, your coin. Put it to good use. A thousand thanks. I shan't forget it. Now to the matter at hand. I know the fellow you seek, though I don't know his name. A steady patron. Gets his boots cleaned every few days. He's very good to me. Always pays me a premium. Know where I might find him? No. But you could wait here. Perhaps he'll stop by. Don't have the time for that. Sure you don't know where to find him? Or maybe notice which direction he came from? When I clean boots, sir, I do not look up to see where folk come from. I clean. Oh. It seems you're having a rough go of it. Oh, you're here. Feeling better? I am, thank you. The local necropolis. The air does wonders for me. Now, if I might intercede, I dare say I've the right question to ask. Young man, do you see this vial? One drop added to your boot polish will help you wipe even the most encrusted boot clean as the dome of St. Lebioda's Cathedral. With it, you will serve three times as many patrons at a fraction of the effort and piles more coin. I'm prepared to give you this vial if you tell me where the man we seek lives. Uh, but you won't hurt him, will you? The gentleman's art, true, but he's kind. In point of fact, mm. he's a friend. Yet we had a falling out of sorts and would like to straighten matters out. I leave his boots at the door of a house near the port. The door is red, but I do not know if the gentleman lives there. Worth checking. Might happen on a lead. Would you let me scrape the dirt off your kickers before you go? With all due respect, sirs, your boots could stand a cleaning. Thank you. Hmm. Perhaps later. É, é bom, é bom em negócios, Regis. Handle that Regis. kid pretty well. Finding the right approach. That's the trick to dealing with children. Hmm, yeah, saw that. Meaning huh. the right thing to bribe them with. Uh, 
Parece que sabes bem, não é? Red Door, one the boot black mentioned. Hum, vamos ver se está cá alguém. Hum, corvos. Won't budge. Gotta break it down. You might just as well stand out in the street, pound on a drum and holler, Detlaf, I'm coming for you. A bit more finesse, I implore you. Let's hear your idea. Give me a moment. Oh. Nice. Ever consider becoming a burglar? A skill like that would come in awful handy. I considered it briefly, but ultimately concluded it would be terribly dull. Come. Stop it. Pois, porque dava para ganhar assim muita coisa com esta técnica. Coisas de madeira. Brinquedos. Sense him. No, he's not here, but he was here recently. His scent is still strong. Toby. Mm. Let's look around. Ai, peço desculpa, maldinha, mas estou um bocado constipado. Ui, tem muita. Old toy, no use to anyone. Shame, must have brought someone joy sometime. I find these quite disturbing. Oh, examinar, examinar, pilhar. Quer é pilhar? Hmm, somebody fixed this recently. Attic, let's go. So this is his nest. Need to look around. Dead love under Eretain. You do not know us, but we know you to be a vampire. We know also of your weakness for the wench they call Renoed. Now you know this. We shall chain her down and let rats feed on her. We shall flay the skin from her flesh. Yet you can save her. You need but travel to Beauclair, where you shall slay five men in the manner we prescribe. You must complete the killing in three days. Fail, and the next letter you receive will contain a memento of your failure, your beloved's finger. There you have it. Proof positive Detlav killed not of his own accord. A blackmailer sunk his claws into him. How is this possible? Who's Renawed? His one-time lover. The sole human woman with whom he was very close. Because she accepted him. With her aid and care, he found a place for himself in this hostile world. She began the work that I strive to continue. Ever meet her? Never had the pleasure, alas. She deserted him a time before he came round to save me. Though he always claimed she'd gone missing. Why do you think that? Any signs or clues to that effect? None to be found. Apparently she disappeared one day. Her belongings disappeared with her. Not a scenario one associates with kidnapping. In my humble opinion, she left on her own. Scared off, perhaps, by a bout of Detlaf's rage that revealed his other, more monstrous side. Detlaf have trouble letting go, accepting that she'd left him. Is that so hard to believe? Do you know no humans who've struggled with just such a thing? And Detlaf is so much more emotional than most humans. Not only was she his beloved, his lover, his mate, she was a member of his pack. And one never leaves one's pack voluntarily. Oh. Even if Renoed did abandon him that time, looks like someone's actually kidnapped her this time. Hard to argue with that. And hard to foresee what he's prepared to do to free her, get her back. 
He's prepared to kill, that's clear. As would you be for Yennefer. He kills for he cares for her deeply. And that blood, those individuals, they mean nothing to him. Push. Dove. Yeah, I get it now. He's out to rescue a female from his pack. Exactly. Right, so someone's blackmailing him. We know that. Still have no idea who. Need to look around some more. Tools were used recently. Tedloff unwind by fixing toys mm. between murders. Really now, Geralt, must you? Nice to look at some certain why but it reminds me of home our true home mas cartas look slips of paper name on each count crespi count dulac milton de perac perin count de lacroix detlaf's victims one and all but that's not his hand must have come from whoever wrote the letter all of it written using the same ink hmm See the color? Ink was dyed with cinnabarite. Rare mineral, pretty much found only in... Nazaire. But I fear it means very little. Anyone could have imported such ink. Fair enough. Still worth remembering. Look, this slip is stained. With wine. Not much to go on either. Especially not in Beauclair. Perhaps. Yet perhaps also worth remembering. Hmm. Okay. Let's sum up what we know. Seems Detlaf's being blackmailed. Someone's been feeding him his victims' names. All noted down using one and the same Nazari ink, and not in his handwriting. Not much. But enough to ascertain Detlaf's innocence, clearly. Actually, it is. Detlaf's being manipulated. Some lunatics turned him into a tool, making him kill. So it would seem. But this illuminates a path of action for us. We must find Renowed. Render the blackmail senseless. The lunatic or ticks will thus lose hold on Detlaf. That's one idea. Hmm. Could be worth a shot. But what about Detlaf? He gonna go on killing while I'm out searching for his lover? He will not. I shall convince him to stay his hand. Assure him you're a friend seeking to help. I'll await him here. He's sure to return sooner or later. Mm. Think he'll listen? He will. I'd have waited with you, maybe. No, he'll sense you from a mile off. Simply fail to appear. I'd better stay alone. You must trust me on this. Fine. Need to report to the Duchess first. So be it. We'll await you here. Detlaf and I both. Hmm. Okay. Ah, nem vi o resto. Pera calma. Deixa me ver o resto. Ver se está aqui mais alguma treta para empilhar. Não. Nível 43. Caralho. Três coisas subníveis. Ui, estás a morrer ou o quê? Onde é que tu estás? Carpeado? Oh, meu Deus. Posso acelerar. Aí aqui não dá. Só até para acelerar ali. Relatado que as notícias dessa caçada da ferro. Por acaso as. As tonalidades desta DLC estão muito, estão muito bonitas, não sei, digam vocês aí nos comentários. Enquanto nós não, não chegamos e não chegamos lá, não se esqueçam de deixar o vosso like, ok? E compartilhar o vídeo e se inscrever, ok?
Aha, esta cidade é, lã, é grande. Agora está a andar aqui às voltas. Já estamos a chegar ao palácio. Antes de chegar. Salvar é sempre bom. Não dá, esquece. Esquece que não dá para fazer isto. Uh. Tem muita coisa para subir. Olha, eu ia vir a pé. Não estava cá nem, nem, nem amanhã. Hum. Vamos dar aqui a volta. Eu não sabia que tinha aqui uma coisa. É pá, com, com esse traje nem dá para falar. Nunca desses. Ela está lá. Está ela. Garrett of Rivia, Master Witcher. I was not mistaken. You arrived and trouble followed soon after. Step aside. Got a matter for the Duchess. At last, Witcher. We've been on tenterhooks. Did you catch Milton's killer? Case is more serious than we thought. The beast? I couldn't kill it. Didn't manage. We sent you after a monster and you returned with nothing? We are very disappointed. The hey, situation is not quite that simple. Beast's a powerful vampire. Ha! <laughs> is this a problem? Is it too much for a witcher? A monster slayer? But everyone knows how to end a vampire. Draw him by trick into sunlight. Or arm yourself with ample garlic and drive a stake through its heart. Garlic's <laughs> useless <laughs> against vampires. Sun and stakes don't hurt him either. Those methods? Pure invention. Only work in legends and fables. And Buckthorn? When I was a child, Grandmama Ademarta always claimed Buckthorn drives off vampires. Silver sword's your best option for keeping them at bay. But it won't get the job done, because only a higher vampire can truly kill another of its kind. Excuses. Ha! Your grace, I shall assemble a batu. Bring the matter to its end at once. The witcher need but tell us where to find this monster. <laughs> Whoa, this is work for a witcher, not for your guardsmen. Yet when a witcher fails, my guardsmen must ah, step era, in. Era I'll take falar. my best. Forty hardened veterans. No vampire can stand up to that. Forty, fifty, a hundred? Doesn't matter. Won't make any difference against him. You have not seen my guardsmen in action. Can they fight fog? Hit a target that moves faster than the wind? How? What creature can do such things? Creatures like this one. Higher vampires, we call them. Each one's a little different. Unique or exceptional, you might say. Some transform into giant bats. Others communicate with animals, command them. Yet all are still brainless beasts. Dead wrong. Thinking of lesser vampires. Alps, Ekamaras, Catacans, for instance. They're ruled by instinct, sure. Attack anything that smells of blood. Higher vampires? They think. They employ reason. Hmm. Monsters driven by reason. A curious contention. What then do you intend to do? Try to talk to him. That's our best bet. I cannot believe this. Her grace summons a witcher to kill a monster. Instead, he wishes to chat with it. <laughs> know what I'm doing. His lover was kidnapped. He's being blackmailed. Blackmailed? Be so kind as to explain how a vampire might be blackmailed. Higher vampires? They're like us, motivated by emotions, not instinct. Not only are they intelligent to an extreme, they're emotionally rich, capable of feeling many things, even love. This one yeah. fell in love with a woman, a human, 
and he'll do anything to keep her from harm. You do not, I trust, suggest we let Milton's killer go free. Or wait until it murders again. We must render it harmless as quickly as possible. I'll find the blackmailer, free the vampire's lover. You were to destroy him, not help him. No one else should die. That's most important. As soon as the woman's safe, he'll have no more reason to kill. Hmm. I admit to being swayed, Witcher. You may be right. Do you know anything about the blackmailer? Got one lead. A few scraps of paper. Blackmailer wrote the names of the vampire's victims on them. One of them stained. A drop of wine, looks like. So damn little to go on. You've no idea how wrong you are, my dear. Send for the Ducal Sommelier. Hop, hop! In Tucson, hmm? wine is sacred. Here, there is no such thing as a drop of wine or stains therefrom. They are stains from a drop of Estes, Ervelus, Fiorano. Your Grace wished to see me. <clears throat> Witcher, show him the paper scrap. Benoit, can you determine which wine made this stain? Mmm. Mmm, yes. Yes. The, the west bank of the Sara Tour. No, that, that's rather obvious. Aged in barrels of Beauclair oak. Hue, deep burgundy. Sorry. Clarity, high. It's simple. Sans Real. The 1269 vintage. That's... Sangreal. That's impossible. The wine is produced at Castel Revello. Especially and exclusively for the ducal table. Perhaps some Sangreal was stolen. We must go to the vineyard. See if there's not been an incident. Wait. Your Grace wants to go with me? Out of the question. I hope you do not suppose we will sit on our ducal hiney and do nothing while our duchy is in grave danger. Your Grace, what mm. you propose is far too dangerous. The Witcher should go alone. It pleases me to see you gentlemen finally agree on something. But I've made my decision. We hey, shall go, go. <laughs> accompanied by the best possible escorts. You, Captain, and Geralt. We will travel incognito. We've no wish to give the court any reason to gossip. For the duration of this mission, I release you from your obligation to adhere to court protocol. In short, from now on, I am Anna Henrietta, not your grace. Yes, your okay. grace. Yeah. Witcher, are you ready? Yeah, ready to go. Excellent. Give me a moment. I must don something more appropriate and concealing. Then we will be off. Okay. Há quanto tempo depois, estrada do castelo Revalu. Revalu. Não sei se lê isso assim. Este vampiro, você já enfrentou isso de sua forma antes? Eu já. Como foi que ele terminou? Você o matou? Não tinha que lutar contra ele. Não tinha que matar ninguém. Você já ouviu falar de alguém que enfrentou um vampiro assim? Não ouvi de um homem que enfrentou um, claro. Mas ele não conseguiu matar ele. Finalmente, só um outro vampiro pode matar um vampiro. Can kill a vampire. Não dá, mais do que isso. Tá, é bastante escuro. Escolta. 
Ah, não vou buscar bal. Arrei. Que emoção. Tell me more about this vineyard, Castel Rivello. It's the best in Ortusa. An old master of the winemaking trade, Ramsey. Fabrizio. He trustworthy. He's held his post for years. There's never been a problem. No. I wish to know your thoughts, Geralt. This old man stayed. How did it wind up on the paper? Is someone from the vineyard blackmailing the vampire? Could be a servant. Could be the steward. Could be the wine was just stolen from the estate. We shall know when we arrive. It's not far now. Becky. Slow now. Then the music. Captain de la Tour. We did not expect any visitors from the palace. How are affairs at court? Doubtless you've heard of the Beast of Beauclair. Well, we've our hands full. Especially since the rogue last attacked in the palace gardens. I trust her illustrious highness was not harmed. Kind of you to ask, Master Fabricio. I am well. Your... your grace? We were not warned. I shall order the salon prepared at once. That won't be necessary. As you can see, we are not here on an official visit. Mm, Naturally. Surprise. Might I ask then what has brought you to Castel Ravello? Yeah. This is an inspection. We've got questions. You'll answer them. And who are you, sir, to speak to me this way? This is Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. He has come to Toussaint on my personal invitation. Which is to say... Which is to say I expect you to treat him with the utmost respect. Mm. Of... of course, Your Grace. Did you hear that, witcher? Fabricio will be delighted to answer your every question. Want to talk about saint Real? I am at your service. The Saint Real. How many vineyard workers have access to it? <coughs> One might say only I do. Not like you make the wine all Since. alone. At least a dozen others work here. I see you've little notion how wine is made. Grapes travel a long road before they become Saint Real. The workers assist me only to the stage of fermentation. I see to the maceration personally, and let no one near the fat. Workers, mm. again, assist me during barreling, but then I seal the aging barrels myself, each and every one. The wine lies in the cellar, gains character. Once this process is complete, it becomes Sonreal. And as it happens, only I have the key to the cellar in question. Mm. Who to hauls the board. barrels to the palace? We've our own garrison. Guards who have served here for years and would answer with their heads for the wine. We'll not get anywhere asking questions, I see. It's a waste of time. Your Grace? How am I to understand this? Master Fabricio. We have proof someone's gained access to Sonreal. Someone who should not have. Which means one of two things. Either oh, for you two. lie to our face, or you are an idiot who has had wine stolen from under his nose and not even realized it. In either case, you shall answer for it. But... but... Silence! And listen. I shall inspect the barrels in person 
thus giving you time to reflect. When I return, I expect to hear answers. Remind mm -hmm. me, where is this Andreal stored? In... in the main cellar, around the corner. I'll show you. I shall find it. Give me the key to the cellar and wait here. Oh, of course, Your Grace. Here it is. Come, Ui. Witcher. É, ela é fogo. É, é moça, tu és fogo. What if Fabrizio is blackmailing the vampire? Consider that. He has his flaws, but I would never suspect him of such a thing. He's been very loyal. He owes okay. all he has to me. His father e? frittered away the family fortune. He left his son an encyclopedic knowledge of wine. That is all. Fabrizio lived as a beggar until I appointed him steward of Castel Ravello. Only then did he come into his own. Ah, a ver lá. Eu vou chegar mais rápido que tu. Uh, agora, esquerda ou direita? Let us see if all the barrels are present. Here's the inventory ledger. Okay. Deixa-me ver o que é que está para aí escrito. Vintner's log. Fermentation completed with no complications. Tapped above sediment line. Here it is. Barreling. Everything lines up at first glance. Neatly and thoroughly documented. Then we must follow our other lead. Benoit said the stain came from the 1269 vintage. Let's find it. Okay. Sangreal minus mil sachets of the case. Ada? Carago. No. No, I just. Ervelus. I like it. Quite dry. An excellent wine. You've got. Não é esta. Uh, este, este, não. Este, este. Think everyone and their mothers heard of this wine. Among the best in the world. Castel Ravello is famous for it. Fuliano, no. Fiorano. Caralho. Dandelion's favorite. Adores it. Ah, yes. No. That sophisticated palate of this. Não é aqui. Pompino. Got Pamino over here. Okay. Então não é aqui. Simples. Ok. Há alguma coisa que está aqui mal ou eu... não é aqui? Simples. Floriano, pois, exatamente. Não, não é aqui. Vamos subir a ver se existe mais aqui alguma coisa. Uou, 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 uou. Não é para cair. Calma. Sangreal 1968. Ei, pá. Não está. Opa, sai da frente! Quer dizer que a gente não estamos longe. Oh, oh my god, estou a estar a cair. Sei que era 1970. 1270 vintage. That's the wrong year. Keep looking. É, não estou longe. Sai! Aqui é este certeza. Não? Cara, aquele é 70, este é 68. Ah, então o 1969 deve estar perto. Ah, aqui está ele. 
Right here. 1269. What now? Let's see if any barrels are empty. Wanna open them? For now, a knock will suffice. If you hear a hollow thud, we will have found what we seek. Full. No, cheio. Também eu consigo notar, né? This one's full too. Full. Cheio. This one's full too. Tá estranho. Full. Looks like all the barrels are full. Dead end, I'm afraid. Full they are. The question is, are they full of Sandria? Get out of the hammer. We shall open them one by one and taste. Ready. We can start. Vamos começar. Ah. Ready. Step aside. Ah, tá quase. So. Hmm. I'd recognize this taste anywhere. This one is good. Eu abri os todos, por isso. Só estou à tua espera. Ei, vais ficar bebada depois disto. <risos> Ai, é ok. Revolting, bitter, plonk. Could have gone sour wine, Jane. <coughs> Impossible. This is not wine. This is contaminated refuse that should never have made it into a barrel. The fact that it did was no accident, I'm sure. Master Fabricio, let's see what he has to say about it. Hmm. Let's discover it. Uh -huh. Master Fabricio, I am very disappointed. But your grace, uh, I... You are a step away from losing your head. Speak the truth and you might yet keep it. I, I, I admit it. I, I, I sold a barrel of Sorreal. I beg you to forgive me. Oh, sorry. Why did you do it? I couldn't resist. The sum they offered, it was enormous. I gave in. Is what I provide not enough? I wished to buy back my family's estate. For here... Nothing is truly mine. I've a roof over my head, ample food to eat, but what is a nobleman without land of his own? I shall tell you everything if you agree to show me mercy. Sir. Really thought nobody'd find out. I was a fool, very foolish. I beg you, Your Grace, you must forgive me. Jesus. Who do you sell the wine to? A few weeks passed at the pheasantry, a rich nobleman approached me. He, he called himself a diplomat, well connected at court. He suggested we embark on an enterprise. Some of his clients had offered dizzying sums for even a drop of Sonreal. He was to serve as intermediary. This man's name? He never revealed it. He was tall, black-haired, and spoke with a foreign lilt. He claimed to hail from Sintra. I've no Sintrian aristocrat at court. Mm. Wine itself. How do you hand it over? We met under the cover of darkness in the ruins of Fort Astre. A dozen or so men came to collect. Armed men. The kind that stink of trouble. 
I had hauled the barrel there. They transferred it to their cart, and we went our separate ways. That's it? That the last you ever saw of them? They... That is to say, a, a few days passed. A, a messenger arrived. He said they wished to buy another barrel, and... Well, I've prepared it. Have it ready to deliver. Uh, That's enough. Know all we need to know. Your Grace, I beg your forgiveness. Get out of my sight. Captain, have your men take Master Fabrizio to the dungeon. He must answer for his crime. High treason the charge. What now, Witcher? We set a trap. Need to catch the wine thieves. Sintry and Noble could be our blackmailer. Next, transport. I'll take it to Fort Astra. Damien and his soldiers will cover me. For once, I agree with you. We will do as you say. Let me know when you are ready. There's no reason to wait. Let's get going. We will set out now. Position ourselves before you arrive. You take the cart and meet us there. Fine. When the handoff begins, watch for my signal. Yeah. <coughs> Achamos a isca. Aí estão eles. Oh, são bandidos. Ah, our favorite vintner. Esta espada é muito boa, a sério. Jesus, tanta gente. Is it just me or did we agree you'd wait for my signal? That was the plan, but great shot. Good thing you reacted. Can't say how that would have ended otherwise. At your service. It was a good fight. We managed to capture one of the scoundrels. Let's ask him a few questions. Come on. Witcher, a moment. I was wrong about you. Tata. Don't need to like each other. Just gotta do our jobs. If that's how you wish to treat it. At any rate, I see the effort you put forth. And I appreciate it. Let us go to her grace. She awaits nearby. Wait, she here? 
I hope you did not think I would leave this to you alone, especially when every hour could prove essential. This prisoner hey. of yours, bring him to me. We must ask him some questions. Captain, do the honors. Who sent you? His name is Dog. They say he plowed your mother. Remember? Once again, who sent you? Your nun's lover. They call him. Wait. He doesn't wish to speak. He needs it. I can think of several other ways he can be helpful. I'm certain Oi. the Witcher will need bait to lure the beast of Beauclair. What? <laughs> Sorry. Sure can. Fresh out. In that case, he's all yours. Captain, Captain, have your men find me a strong rope, kind that won't snap when we hang this fellow from a tree. R rope? Yep. Live bait, <laughs> great for monsters, provided they catch the scent of its blood. But I'll see to that. <coughs> what? No. Cracky, no! Don't let him! Stop screaming. Save your strength. Got a long night ahead of you. No! Don't let him! I I'll talk! That's the exercise. Who hired you? He... he'll kill me! Ought to be worried about me right now. Who is he? Go on, man. Spit it out. The Cintrian? That is what they Cintrian. call him. I've never seen him, but I know he mustered the man for this caper. That's what they said, that we were working for the Cintrian. I don't know anything else. I swear it. Hmm. Take him away. Throw him in the dungeon. He shall await trial there. Captain, we ride to town. Gather your men and seek out the Cintrian. Someone else must have seen him, must know of him. Yes, Your Grace. I'll report to the palace as soon as I learn anything. I shan't return to the palace. Our mission has not yet ended. The Witcher and I will await you at the guard post near the port. Uh, I'll join you. We'll meet there. We shall await your arrival. E antes de acabar o episódio, vou lá abaixo, já dei. Apanhar esta essas coisas todas. Antes de acabar, mal tinha, mas é só apanhar esta treta, depois depois vender, obviamente. Ah, e... Yeah. Calma. Só apanhar isto e basicamente. Oh, onde é que ela está? E bem maltinha, espero que vocês tenham gostado. Se gostaram, deixem o vosso like e inscrevam-se não são inscritos. Isto é tudo com vocês arrobando capa e fui!